Alright, so we just got a new data download on the JP side of the game for part 2 of the Worldwide Celebration Global. We'll definitely be getting a similar one within the next couple of hours. But before anybody gets too excited, we did not get any of the animations or details for the upcoming LRs. You know, the uh, Metal Cooler and the Super Saiyan Goku and Vegeta. That's most likely coming within the next 24 hours or so. But for now, we still have some pretty interesting stuff. So uh, real quick, before we jump into it, I want to give a big shout out to my boy Proton10MG on Twitter for posting all these assets. If you guys aren't already following him, then definitely go ahead and do so. As you can see, he is stupidly close to 5k followers. So let's get him there as quickly as possible. In fact, I'm going to say we can do it by the end of tonight or tomorrow morning at the latest so let's get it guys okay so from there let's scroll down a little bit and start with the new worldwide celebration part 2 promo movie which i haven't seen yet but i've been told there are some new animations from the upcoming lars so i'm pretty excited let me just quickly pause the music here and enjoy guys Okay, so there you go guys, that was the part 2 promo movie. We definitely saw some uh, new animations here. Not the beginning, because that was for the LR Bird Coup, obviously, but uh, the tail was new. Uh, I'm not sure if the big Getty Star was already in the game from maybe like a story event or something like that, but we got the big Getty Star. This is definitely the animation for one of the super attacks for the Metal Cooler, and then we got the Goku, and the Goku and Vegeta. So very brief snippets, obviously the full animations are much longer, but I like what I see so far. I like what I see so far. Now one thing that is slightly confusing is the part where Cooler's arm gets crushed, right? Is that from Cooler's animation or is it from Goku and Vegeta's animation? I guess it would make more sense for it to be Goku and Vegeta, but at the same time it wouldn't be a super attack since you're not, you're not always going to be fighting a middle cooler, right? So maybe it's part of like one of their active skills or something like that. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But either way, we got some animations. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys feel or how you guys feel about what we see so far. The little that we see so far. I think cooler looks very, very clean. It looks really good. And Goku and Vegeta, you know, they look fine too. Um, one thing that has been confirmed is that Goku and Vegeta are going to be the Dokkan Fest unit this time, and Cooler is going to be the uh, Carnival Summon, right, like Bird Coup was. And I'm not really sure how I feel about that. I'm not really sure, because on the one hand, uh, that does mean that Goku and Vegeta are going to be more exciting to summon for, because their banner is going to be really good, but on the other hand, I want the cooler more, so I'm going to be probably spending more stones on a worse banner, which is going to be the carnival banner. Or maybe they'll fix it, maybe they'll make it better, maybe they'll increase their rates, who knows? We'll see. But anyways, uh, that is the promo movie. Let's move on to some of the other assets now. Uh, we got the awakenings for the free-to-play metal coolers. This is for the SDR metal cooler. And then we also have the five other type uh, specific coolers or rather you know the coolers with like their type in their name right so we got the AGL cooler we have the tech cooler the int cooler the STR cooler and finally the fizz cooler so six metal cooler free-to-play metal cooler token awakenings right there 
And then we have uh, two new Token Awakening medals. This is for the STR cooler, and this is for all of the other metal coolers. And uh, we also have some new stages for the Battle for the Strongest in the Universe event, stages 5, 6, 7, and 8. And you guys can take a quick look at the maps, not really anything too crazy. And uh, as far as the release date goes for all this stuff, it's going to be uh, September 9th at 6 a.m. GMT. So roughly, you know, like a day and a half from now, right? Or something like that. We're close. We're very close. And uh, after that, we have a new limited and challenge event, or new limited and challenge events. The first one is Do Your Best Large Army Approaching. And stage one is the Looming Legion. So this, I believe, is... Uh, I think it's the Link level stage, right? Yeah, it's the Metal Cooler uh, Link level stage, where it has a Link level rate of 38.25, which, if I remember correctly, is higher than the Elder Guru stage. I think. I think either way. Um... It's going to give you a really good chance to increase your link levels. So that is the first new event. And then we have uh, Extreme Z Area for the three free-to-play units. Uh, stage 1, 2, and 3 for... Uh, we'll see the units in a second, but these are the three maps. And the units are the free-to-play Gohan and Goku. The free-to-play Tech Final Form Cooler. And finally, the free-to-play... Uh, wait, hold on. Oh yes, he is free to play, right? Wait, which cooler is this? Which cooler is this? It's not the AGL metal cooler, so this is... I'm actually a little bit... Oh no, it's the <laughs> it's the STR metal cooler. My bad. It's the STR metal cooler. I didn't recognize the art because of the way it was framed, I guess. I don't really know, but either way, it's the Token Awakening for the STR metal cooler. And uh, this is... His Extreme Z Awakening medals, or these are his Extreme Z Awakening medals. It's late, guys. My brain is not working properly, so that's my bad. But moving on, we have uh, the new Planet Namek in Crisis breaking through Super Armor stage. And uh, this is where you fight a bunch of the, uh, I think, the robot soldiers, or I forgot exactly what they're called. Um, I think it's like opian guards or something like that but either way yeah we're fighting a bunch of the soldiers and uh, there's five different stages for each uh type and i think you get rewards based on how many of the soldiers you can take down i'm not exactly sure how it's gonna work but uh it sounds interesting it sounds interesting so there you go new event right there and then we also have the two new stages for the Ultimate Red Zone, Wicked Bloodline is the, uh, uh, Wicked Bloodline Edition. I can't even talk anymore, man. It's too late. I gotta sleep. Okay, two new stages. First one is versus Mecha Frieza and King Cold. And the other stage is versus uh, Metal Cooler. And we also have the Extreme Z Battle slash Extreme Z Awakening for the AGL Metal Cooler. There is the... Uh, logo for the event. Obviously, it's going to be in English for the global side. And then we have the Metal Cooler himself, along with some cut ins, some super attack lines, and then his uh, Extreme Z Awakening medals. If you guys want to know exactly what he does, I did post a video with his uh, EZA details, so feel free to go check that out from this morning. And we have a new ticket, which is, of course, for the. Wait, hold on. Oh yeah, it's for the new stages of uh, Ultimate Red Zone, Wicked, Wicked Bloodline Edition, and uh, a new login screen as well. Now this one is very interesting. Metal Cooler is looking very... Uh, what's the word? Fabulous, I guess. Looking good, looking good. And then we have some other assets, of course, as well from the login screen. And we're also going to take a look at the animated screen in a second as well. And I got to say, it might be my favorite login screen of all time, or at least like in the top five. And uh, yeah, I'll show you guys in a second. So yeah, some more assets for the new login screen. There you go. And uh, new OST, which I'm not going to play here because I'm a little bit concerned that uh, it's going to get copyright striked. So yeah, new OST, feel free to go check that out. And also some new scripted assets as well, a couple of Gokus, a couple of Vegeta's, 
another Vegeta, and uh, some more Super Saiyan Gokus, some Metal Coolers right there, and a Robot Soldier as well. And I think that pretty much does it guys for the assets we got from this data download. Uh, mostly for the new events, of course, the Dokkan Awakenings, the Extreme Z Awakenings. No new LRs, unfortunately, like I said, but that's coming within the next uh, 24 hours, most likely. And before we go, I just want to quickly show you guys the uh, animation, the Super Attack animation for the new Free to Play Metal Cooler Awakenings, as well as the new login screen. So here we go. Let me pause the music again and check it out and yeah that's pretty much it that's pretty much it it's uh nothing too crazy apparently all six of the free to play metal coolers have the same animation which is a little bit unfortunate but i guess it makes sense because they didn't want to animate six different animations for the free-to-play units but uh that is the dokkan awakening super attack for the middle coolers and here is the new login screen which uh i'm gonna pause real quick i'm gonna full screen but i'm going to actually mute it because it might play the new ost which once again is uh might be a copyright issue so anyways check this out guys Oh, nope. <laughs> Yo, I don't know what it is. It's just something about this, <laughs> this, this, this beginning part with the metal cooler. Oh my god, it just looks so menacing. It looks so sick, man. I don't know. I love it. I love it. So there's the new login screen. Absolutely amazing. And that's going to do it for today's data download, guys. Oh, let me just turn the music on real quick before we go. Let's play um, LR Goku and Majita. Why not? There we go. And uh, yeah, once again, a big shout out to my boy Proton10MG. Thank you for posting the assets as you always do. Make sure to get him to 5k followers, guys. I want to see it by, by tomorrow. I really do. And... Uh, yeah, of course, once the details and animations for the upcoming Outlars drop, I'll make sure to keep you guys informed as soon as possible. So uh, if you guys are not subs to the channel yet, then make sure to hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad. Subscribe to the channel and uh, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And I'm doing this out of order, so the last thing I'll say, I guess, is if you guys like today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger, with Tiger, Uppercut Video, signing out. <laughs>